So here we're going to do a really simple loop stitch called the Van Dyke stitch. Um, it's good for making leaves and flower petals and such. So what you do is you bring the thread up and then you make a diagonal line and bring the thread through again, sort of like an upside down or a little X with the leg spread at the bottom. And then you bring your thread through again um, below the the little diagonal on the left side. Then you are going to put your needle thread through the top part of the X. So it makes a little loop. And all you have to do is make sure that your loops are kind of even. Hmm, mine are actually aren't the best this time, but you will make sure yours are better than mine. And then you bring your thread through. Um, I'm going to make it out a little bit further just to even up my stitch on the right hand side and you do it again and this time you go around the next little X that you just did herringbone stitch if you actually wanted to know what that X was called in embroidery and so bring your thread through the loop again and you see how you start having um, a nice little vertical pattern with the raised loops in the middle. So one more time, bring your needle through in between the loops and down again. And there you have your Van Dyke stitch.